which shall prepare thy way before thee. Which shall prepare thy way before thee. Will give you instruction on what way to walk. Verily I say unto you, among them that are born of woman, there hath not risen a greater than John the Baptist. Now listen to this. You remember what that they asked Apollos said, well then, what were you baptized unto? We were baptized unto John's baptism. And after Aquila and Priscilla and Apollos, they met 12 others, and uh, Paul explained to them, this is the one that John was talking about. Then they repented and was baptized, in the name of Jesus Christ. People know well, what difference does it make? It makes a lot of difference as to whether we understand what John did and what Jesus Christ did. Now listen to it closely this morning. I say unto you, among them that are born of women, there is not risen a greater than John the Baptist, Notwithstanding, he that is least in the kingdom of heaven is greater than he. John the Baptist, the greatest man, Jesus said, and now he was the first cousin of Jesus Christ. He was six months older than Jesus. And he said, There have not risen anybody greater than John the Baptist, but John the Baptist. Uh, is not as great as the least in the kingdom of heaven. John the Baptist came to tell us there is a way, and put that way, that prepare thy way before thee. John the Baptist came and prepared the way before us. He became a messenger and said, this is the one. I am not the light, I am a witness of the light. So Jesus said, the least in the kingdom of heaven is greater than he. And from the days of John the Baptist until now, the kingdom of heaven suffereth violence. From the day of John the Baptist until now, the kingdom of heaven suffered violence. The one that you see the dove descending remaining on is the one that I am not worthy to stoop down and loosen or tie his shoelaces. He is going to baptize you with the Holy Ghost and with fire. Glory to God. Amen. Amen. Whenever he was saying, I baptize you in water, a baptism of repentance, a baptism of reaffirmation of the morality of the law which no one could live up to. The priests could not fulfill it. They could not live up to its demands. So John said, I baptize you indeed with water, but the one that is coming after me that is preferred before me He's going to baptize you with the Holy Ghost and with fire. He said here, the kingdom of heaven suffered violence from when? From the time that John the Baptist identified the Lamb of God that taketh away the sin of the world, they went about to put him to death. Why? Because Jesus Christ is the kingdom of heaven. Amen? Yes. Amen. Hello, glory to God. Amen. The Bible said the kingdom does not come by observation. The kingdom of God dwells in you. Amen? So when the king moves in, the kingdom then expresses itself in you and through you. For well, from the days of John the Baptist until now, the kingdom of heaven suffered violence and the violent Take it by force. Glory to God. Now listen to what he said. 
We, we, we've got a, a, a switch around wrong here in the church world. They're talking about the church being defeated and the church having to be snatched out just before it's destroyed. Where did you come up with such a, a, an idiotic idea? The church will not, cannot. The church has suffered violence and the violent take it by force. Listen to what Jesus said. Matthew 16 Upon this rock, I build my church. Upon the confession that thou art the Christ, the Son of the living God, I build my church. And the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. It's not hell coming against the church. It's the church prevailing at the gates of hell. The gates of hell shall not stop the kingdom of God from fulfilling the will of God on this earth. Jesus came, his birth, we celebrate it with great adoration and in my house with a great expense. Then we come to the, the, to the mission of Jesus Christ. Why did he come to the earth? Why was the invisible God manifested in human flesh? Thy will be done in earth even as it is in heaven. The kingdom of God suffers violence and the violent take it by force. This means with great pressure, with great power. Glory to God. Why? Well, I already know that the devil's defeated. Now, how, how do we look at the world that we're living in? Our president's hair is turning gray. Hillary Clinton, uh, that looked like a young uh, woman just a few months back, uh, looks like an old woman today, all uh, getting drugged and stupid. Why? They understand the predicament. They understand the fine line of how close we are of destroying the human family off of the face of the earth. Amen. The Bible said men's hearts failing them for fear of what's coming on the face of the earth. Amen. Glory to God. But listen to what it said. And the violent take it by force. For all of the prophets... And the law prophesied until when? Everything that comes after John has to be interpreted through the word. If you're coming up with something that's not in the word, you are coming up with a fable. You're coming up with a false prophecy because the prophets prophesied until John. Let me remind you this morning of what Paul said in Hebrews 11, uh, Hebrews uh, 1, 1 to 3. For in divers, in sundry times, in divers manner, God spoke to our fathers by the prophets. But in this last day, he has spoken unto us how? by his son. Glory to God. If, if you are going to hear from God, if you're going to hear from a God that no one has ever seen, no one can ever look upon him, if you're going to look upon that invisible God, the only way you can see him, the only way you can communicate with him is through the way that John the Baptist prepared for the coming of the kingdom of heaven. I have prepared the way for the king. Glory to God. And greater is he that is in the kingdom of God than John the Baptist. Amen. Why? Because we have entered in the kingdom. The kingdom has entered in the, listen to what it said. For all the prophets and the law prophesied unto John. In the prophecy, fulfillment of law. Why? Because Jesus Christ was manifested in the flesh to bring the will of God to the earth. 